please bear with me, but we're going to break protocol and go straight to the outcome in this one particular study because the results are just incredible. To start with the outcome, as follows, participants showed an average decrease of 8% in total cholesterol on the cottonseed oil diet, along with a 15% decrease in low density lipoprotein and a 30% decrease in triglycerides. We are not talking months, we are not talking years, we are talking literally just within a five day period of time. Also, with that note, our mission here is not to interpret the research, is only to bring the research to your attention. There's going to be questions in regard to cottonseed oil, cottonseed processing, and also omega-6 itself. So I'm just here to bring your attention to what ended up being an amazing study. So let us proceed as follows. Study links cottonseed oil with lower cholesterol. By the way, the diet also increased high density lipoproteins or HDL good cholesterol by 8%. Five days. To proceed, the subjects, all healthy men between the ages of 18 and 45 provided high fat meals for five days in two separately or separate tightly controlled trials. The only difference being was the use of either cottonseed oil or olive oil in the meals. With that in mind, we are now going to break to the abstract itself. Now, the diet is only alluded to in regard to the fat content. As more information is released or the full study is released, I'll provide that in the comment section below in regard to the videos. But let us proceed into the abstract. 15 normal weight men completed a randomized control design with two control, uh, controlled feeding trials. Three day lead in diet, pre diet visit, five day CSO being cottonseed oil, or OO being olive oil rich diet, post diet visit. The five day diets, 50% fat, were rich in either cottonseed oil or olive oil. A five day CSO or cottonseed oil rich diet led to improvements in cholesterol and triglycerides, being TG, whereas there was no changes observed in the olive oil rich diet. Remember, we're only talking a five day period of time, and we always want to bring your attention to the research, not interpret it. So let's go back to the press release in regard to the study itself. Researchers suggested a fatty acid unique to cottonseed oil, again, unique to cottonseed oil, otherwise known as dehydro sterculic acid, may help prevent the accumulation of triglycerides, a type of fat in the body. And here's a little gem, which I hope future research is also conducted on as well. You'll catch on to it in a second. By doing that, it pushes the body to burn more of that fat because it cannot or can't store properly, quoting the researchers. So you have less lipid and cholesterol accumulation. That's a pretty cool little uh, uh, gem in the research itself. And to go a little further, that mechanism, in addition to the high polyunsaturated fat and omega-6 content of cottonseed oil, seems to be a key component to the beneficial effects on lipid profiles. Again, I know the debate in regard to omega-6, just bring in the research to your attention, leave the interpretation to future trials in which the researchers say they would like to conduct. Again, pretty fascinating study. DOI citation will be listed so you can read, about, read on it on your own. Five days, 30% reduction in triglycerides on a cottonseed oil diet. It with no change on the olive oil as far as if we want to consider that your control. Now, it doesn't mean olive oil doesn't have benefits to itself. But in this case, when it comes to triglycerides, cottonseed oil holds a tremendous amount of promise, provided future studies confirm this particular study as well. And I see no reason why not, but again, that's publisher bias, and we want to avoid that. Ralph Church Channel, signing off once again. Hope you find this information of use. Thank you very much for listening, and I look forward to seeing you all again in seven days. Catch you then. Bye.